Hi guys, I'm in the bunker here for a bunker tip for you. What I've been noticing after lockdown is a lot of people getting in touch saying they're struggling to get out of the bunkers. And the main thing is they're leaning back trying to scoop it so they're striking into the sand a long way behind the ball. What I mean by that is they'll set up and then try help out the sand so when you lean back you generally crash into the sand back here and it ends up resulting in the ball just moving a foot or so and you're still stuck in the bunker okay if that's something you're struggling with here's a couple of tips to help so once you set up you want to have the club face open and then take your grip the reason for that is you want the sole of the club to glide through the sand when you play it from a square face, the front edge digs into the sand. Whereas when you have it open, the club will glide through the sand better. And also it will help you get a high soft shot. Secondly, I want you to get your weight on your front leg. So for us right-handed golfers, that's going to be your left leg. And then that way you're going to avoid yourself backing up and trying to scoop it. A drill for you to try is come over to the practice bunker, use it, it's here for a reason. So before you tee off, come over just for five minutes, draw a line in the sand, put that in line with your left heel, and just practice striking the line. Okay? You'll notice at the start you sometimes strike quite a bit before the line, but after practice you'll get consistent at striking the line. That way you'll enter the sand at the same point every time. Once you feel you've done this, which is a great drill, you can never do it enough, you'll just get great at it. Put the ball in front of the line and do the same thing. And the ball should come out high and soft, okay? So hopefully that helps the bunker problems. The three keys there are get the club face open and then grip it, get the weight onto your left leg, and make sure you do a full swing and commit to it and see the ball pop out of the sand. Okay? Give that a try, hope that helps.